hello friends today let's see how to create employee salary sheet in ms excel 2016 so first of all we need to criteria of employee salary sheet so what is the criteria of uh, employee salary sheet here is the basic criteria of employee first of all employee salary sheet have filled employee id employee name designation basic hra da ma pf gross salary net salary uh, where designation are ceo manager accountant clerk peon where hra house rent allowance is 80% uh, of basic da dearness allowance is at one uh, 20% it is not uh, one uh, 120% of basic ma medical allowance if basic is less than 5 thousand then 500 rupees otherwise 10,100 uh, PF provident fund is 8% of basic now suppose we create all these things then find a maximum minimum and average salary of employee then count manager accounting clerk peon uh, how many uh, manager and account in this uh, seat and sum of all manager manager salary net salary now let's start how to create this site so first of all we have first one excel sheet so employee id employee name designation so here is the employee 101 102 103 and uh, now let's drag 10 okay 8 now m a a a employee name b b b c c c d d d and uh, e e e f f f g g g h h h it is a suppose employee it, it is the name of employee now designation someone have manager and ceo accountant accountant account accountant and clerk pune again manager and uh, pune is a clerk so it is a basic site so now i will give the border of this site order and uh, some formatting first of all we create some formatting okay this is our formatting so give row height 35 okay give the um, bookman bookman old style Bookman old style, that is a good style. Bold. Then we give the height of row 25. Okay, so it is so for neat and clean. This is for this formatting is for neat and clean okay right click and go format cell number uh, center and center okay here is a, some wrap text format wrap text why it is a out of so employee name designation column Some basic formatting to give row height forty uh, percent. Good formatting here. Format cell is a very useful dialog box. Okay, so now and here we add some row employee salary slip and merge cell. Okay, we can merge cell employee salary 
seat give the height of this first we select then give height okay now change row height uh, 50% okay now background color is uh, something is like and the color is color is like white so it is a neat and clean some professional look so here name is uh, left side so now put the basic salary someone have five uh, eight thousand CEO with truncate uh, remount of all our point and how uh, CEO CEO one fifty lakhs right fifteen thousand and uh, eleven uh, fifteen thousand eleven thousand then Clark have three thousand you have fifteen hundred manager have um, thirteen thousand this manager have change value on 12 then pune as a 2000 and clark has a five thousand uh, sorry 3500 so now we start the basic look of uh, employee salary uh, seat so now we can calculate we can uh, make a formula here is the basic thing hra is uh, 18 percentage 120 percentage uh, okay ma is now we can calculate this thing now make a formula is equal to basic salary into 20 percentage here is the percentage is what 18 percentage so 18 percentage uh, divide by 100 enter now it can change so uh, HR is a complete here is a basic salary DA is a 120 divide by 100 so this is the DA and MA MA having a condition if basic salary if if basic salary greater than 5000 greater than or equal to 5000 then 10000 uh, 100 otherwise 500 it can easily now value is uh, above 5000 so and below 5000 500 500 and pf pf is uh, criteria what about pre eight percentage? So uh, basic salary into eight divide by hundred. So it is a formula eight. Otherwise we can write here zero point eight is also considerable. Same thing. Both are same thing. Now gross salary means uh, means hra plus da plus ma minus pf it is a gross salary here is it is a gross salary now what is next net salary net salary is equal to uh, basic plus basic plus gross it is a net salary so suppose uh, someone have 12,000 basic then its net salary is 19,960 so now it is a basic salary so we can find maximum maximum we can find minimum 
me minimum then average average so here is the maximum in the bracket now find the criteria and enter equal to minimum we want mean function then put the criteria it is a array then equal to average in the bracket now select a range then enter here is a maximum net value minimum average then you can find accordingly whatever we want to find so employee salary rate we can find maximum minimum now we can count count manager how many manager in this seat how many uh, manager how many manager manager so is equal to count count if now select range then comma manager then we can get how many manager in this employee salary set now count count sum all sum designation wise sum designation wise sum designation wise sum designation wise total salary designation wise total salary See, so here is equal to sum if function then select designation wise total select range comma criteria criteria manager summary of here range manager then comma find manager then select some criteria here is a some criteria then enter here is a 41500 manager 19 and this manager is uh, 21 so it can 19 and 20 it is a 41 so this one and this one both are manager so now clear pun mm, accountant turn now accountant okay uh, same formula equal to count if select criteria comma account turn account done it is a case sensitive whatever you uh, write over here count on it is a case sensitive spelling is co correct otherwise give wrong answer one clerk from this seat clerk find clerk is equal to count if count if find clerk how many clerk in this seat so comma double quotation uh, clerk c capital c r l e r k is a clerk then find clerk now count how many salaries sum if function sum if function select range comma account turn now it's a net salary and enter it can find net salary account 18,000 and another 18,000 exactly amount is one suppose I change account on account and change the salary so it is a very important formula sum if sum if then select designation range comma criteria criteria is a pune uh, sorry clerk then find
define net salary okay enter 1.5204 t then another clerk 6030 6500 11 uh, 11 to 70 it's a correct so uh, how to, this is the formula sum if sum if how to find m count how many manager in this sheet this is the formula okay this is the formula accountant clerk seem like all designation you want to check how many uh, count or designation wise uh, total salary you want to check that you can use this type of formula here is a HRA formula DA formula MA formula right PF PF is a minus from gross salary um, uh, HRA plus DA plus MA plus minus a PF so it is a gross salary then net net salary basic plus gross salary is a net salary so now this is the basic understanding so please and and one more thing in this uh, sheet uh, free spin what is free spin um how to check free spin free spin Okay, no need to free spin is uh, like uh, most important part uh, we want to check hmm, here is the free spin top row free spin select this and check free spin you and select free spin free spin means this is a uh, now again we want to go in a free spin on freeze again free stop then we can change okay free spin is a top row then select one two three on freeze select first uh, first row is a freeze on freeze and select freeze pane freeze pane so it is a free spin first column is a free spin no need to select here first two and then select free spin so it is a free spin so free spin is a important thing so thank you for watching this video please subscribe like comment and share thank you for watching this video thank you